So I believe that everyone's creative, that all, all human beings have creativity. I also believe that there's that of God in everyone. So that makes me think that the creative spark is God. There's something in the moment of when I see you, and if I know you, I light up. And that feeling of light, that feeling of love and connection, I don't think I have to know you to have that connection. And I believe that everyone has that capability for each other. I see it mostly when people are with children and they look at a baby without judgment and they just, they light up, the baby lights up, this, this kind of creative energy of light and space of connection and support in a way that has no judgment in it. And I think that's the answer around um, creativity. And, I, and it's very much tied to the idea of, that, of God in everyone. Hello, my name is Mahayana Landown. I go by Yana, she, her pronouns, and uh, I'm a member of Brooklyn Friends Meeting, and I grew up in Miami Friends Meeting. So I grew up in a, in a small meeting, and my sister and I were uh, flamboyant kids, and we loved dressing up. And there was a time when there were some people in our meeting who were um, complaining that we were distracting them from worshiping. And there were enough adults in the meeting who said, no, we want them to be this way. We want them to be expressive. And, and you can close your eyes or you can sit next to them and so then you don't have to look at them. But that um, basically the adults in that community stood up for us as children so that we could grow up as free, expressive kids. So um, I think there's something in that childhood story that carries through to part of my deep mission of wanting people to feel welcome no matter who they are, no matter what they're carrying, no matter what's going on. So I do interactive performance art. Um, the basic idea is I create a scenario where the, the participant can, can be part of it if they want to be. And, and so I'm looking at how can my art of encouraging engagement and encouraging expression and encouraging creativity align with encouraging that of God and everyone and align with bringing people to, to feel comfortable in their expressiveness and feel not judged no matter where they are because when we're in a space of judgment that shuts down creativity it shuts down expression and it actually shuts down the other person and and I think we get caught in this this wall of, I don't want to get embarrassed, I don't want to say or do the wrong thing, I don't want to hurt anybody. And that blocks us from how amazing you are, how amazing they are, how amazing we could all be together if we lift away the judgment, if we listen with our whole selves, if we allow ourselves to be vulnerable and create together. And creating together can be a conversation. It can be a piece of art. It, there's no, it doesn't matter. But the act of us connecting, having creative engagement, I believe is a key to opening up spirit and opening up a way of connecting outside of judgment. Thanks so much for watching this Quaker Speak video. We release a new video every other Thursday. We'd like to thank the Friends Committee on National Legislation for sponsoring this week's video. The Friends Committee on National Legislation, or FCNL, is a national nonpartisan Quaker organization that lobbies Congress for peace, justice, and environmental stewardship. Join FCNL and tens of thousands of people, Quakers and friends, who share a belief in the power of relationship building to advance the world we seek. Visit FCNL online at www.fcnl.org. Thanks again for watching and have a happy Thursday.